Okay, so I'm stopped here now. So I thought I'd take a minute to update you on our progress. So why I'm stopped here now is uh, the bolt here snapped. So I don't know if you can see here, but it's this lead here is welded on and so is this one. So using the battery powered mini grinder, I had to cut off the old one. Here it is, here's what's left of it. And I'm just putting in a standard 8.8 .8 bolt to get me going. So uh, I uh, have all my bits and pieces out. And I just need my um, washers. Um, yeah, okay. Oh, that's the right one, sorry. Excuse the mess of tool looks. So anyway, so I'll put that thing back together in a minute, but I just, so we're sowing um, spring oats here. The variety was husky. Um, I had ordered um, Isabel, um, but uh, there was none really available. So husky it is. Um, even though there's no seed showing and it's tilling deep, the birds are out there, there's a bit of seed. Um, the birds are still uh, doing their best to uh, steal it and um, this is a new spot we're after renting you probably saw it in the drawn silage video uh drawn silage bales video so we're almost three quarters of the way through the sowing um we have about 70 yeah 70 acres of sowing left and also i'm plowing left um and there's probably a hundred and 80, 180 or 90 acres of sowing left um, after tonight and um, I'm hoping to get this 35 acre block out of it tonight and after that we'll be left with about 170 or 80 acres I'm not sure exactly because um, there's bits here and there that didn't get done because it was too wet so for example in a 45 acre block we have rented I have 30 acres of a sown or 31 acres of a sown but there's 14 acres left because it was too wet and so on and so forth but um, for the most part there's 75 acres of a new block we took on and um, to do all of it has to be done and then there's 63 acres at home to be done and one or two other small bits to be done so we're getting there um drill is doing well other than this little breakdown i've broken an after arrow tine and um, which i'll change tonight but it won't doesn't matter too much because the packer wheels are there and Lemkin's opinion is that we don't need the after harrows but me being me wanted them. Um, 6490 is doing well, new tires are good, new press is good. Um, I would have liked the 3 meter one but for what it is it's doing a good job. Um, there's no real other news going on or anything. Um, the uh, Dung spread is broken down at home, it was spreading dung on the home ground and the bearing went. So uh, my father had to give up spraying to go do that. Um, and he would have given me a hand here only for the fact that uh, he's at that. So my um, mother very kindly dropped me over the mini grinder, a new blade and the bolt which I had at home. But it was actually in the grubber and not the, uh, not the tractor because there's a toolbox in the grubber. So I keep most of my stuff there because it's a good bit bigger than my little toolbox. But anyway, so let's uh, stick this uh, sideboard back on and uh, get uh, get on again. here in a block the ground we have and um, we're just getting set up for the night ahead I'm sorry tomorrow before we go home and um, these are the diesel tanks we have put on the uh, trailer that brings the seed up to the field and um, here's the only tractor we have because our JCB's at dome so yeah um, this is a uh, spring barley brightiest prospect Going in well, uh, 50 acres done today. Uh, well, sorry, I have 65 acres done today, 50 acres done here. 
We're getting out well.